welcome back to my channel. You are watching my mermaid series where I am sketching a new mermaid every day this month of May, filming it and uploading it on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And the way that I am approaching this project is that I am doing a different pattern or texture for the tail of the mermaid. So I'm focusing on that tail area and then I have a list of prompts that I'm following to um, come up with that pattern or texture. So today's prompt was actually ocean. And um, there's a lot of ways that I could have went with it. And one of the things that I thought of first was to do like an ocean scene. So it wouldn't really be a pattern though, but I was gonna do like from the tail up, just do like a bunch of coral and seaweed and maybe some like little fish and just kind of do like an ocean floor um, in that space. But um, I decided it was going to be really, really intricate and hard to kind of make it work with only using green markers. And then I also thought um, it wasn't like a true pattern. So I wasn't really following the rules that I set out for myself. So um, I came up with this idea of doing like a water texture. And I wanted it to be like the reflection of like really clear water and like light and that sort of like ripply wavy look, um, which I guess isn't like really oceany. It's more of like swimming pool, but um, I don't know. There are some oceans that are clear enough to have that effect, but um, or beaches and whatever. Uh, so yeah, I ended up using my like really old hand-me-down iPad to look up a reference photo. And then I just kind of went from there and I just kind of winged it. I have never ever drawn this texture before or um, like even attempted it because it, it always seemed really, really difficult and really intricate. Um, and I have to say it still is, like this is just a really, really loose interpretation of it. Um, but I really like how it came out. It's very, um, different than anything that I think I would have tried um, if I hadn't pulled up that reference photo. So I'm really, really excited about um, this new kind of pattern of doing these like sort of lighter colored highlight lines where like the sun would be, or yeah, when the sun would be like reflecting the most light and then sort of these darker areas of blue um, where the water uh, is just that blue color. I don't <laughs> I feel like I'm not explaining this very well, but um, I don't know, I think it's kind of fun and I like the way I translated it into this really like kind of messy brush stroke um, look with my markers and um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with this one. Um, the pose of the mermaid maybe isn't my favorite and her hair came out a little bit weird but her tail is pretty cute so I'm fairly satisfied today which is again kind of a running theme of like eh, how do I feel about these mermaids but I feel okay about this one. So let's see, um, I'm actually recording this a day late. Um, so this is um, Sunday morning and this is Saturday's drawing or what should have been Saturday's drawing. Um, but I just had a really busy day yesterday. Um, I woke up to like some family issues that I had to deal with, um, which is why I didn't get to do my drawing first thing in the morning like I like to, um, cause I was kind of just putting out some other fires. And then um, I had a little bit of time to myself in the middle of the day, um, in the middle of the morning, I guess. And then I had improv practice with my friends. That was really fun, it went really well. And then um, a little bit after that, we went out to dinner and we went to see a stand-up show at our comedy theater. And it was just a really awesome day. Like I didn't expect to have as much fun as I did. And it was really satisfying after like such a crazy morning that I had had just to kind of go out with friends and get to do fun things and be out on the town and walking around and stuff. And I don't know, I'm just really grateful for the busy day that I had, even though I am sad that I didn't get to draw my mermaid on time. So, um, I don't know, I'm, I'm trying to be a little bit lenient with myself. I'm still gonna have 31 mermaids by the time this is done. It just might not be like, every day. Well, it hasn't been every day, I guess, but probably going forward, I'll get back on track. And so I'm not too worried about it. Um, 
I don't know. That's all I have to say for myself, I guess. Uh, I feel like this was a little bit uh, disjointed. It's still very, very early, and I did not get a lot of sleep last night, so I'm a little loopy. But uh, if you're still watching, I just want to say thank you so much for sticking around and listening and supporting my artwork. If you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos just like it, you can subscribe to my channel. And um, until my next video, thank you so much. Thank you.